Hey, it's Joe Fear from GetThriveCart.com, and in this video, I want to show you why there's a perfect marriage of tools out there that you might want to get. So, if you are on uh, Shopify, e-commerce, or you know some kind of platform, if you're looking for a great e-commerce platform, then you know, you're know you probably aware of Shopify, but you might not be totally aware of how this fits with Thrivecart. You might not have even heard of Thrivecart. Well, I'm gonna show you why you should actually be using both of these things to make a lot more money with a lot less effort. So let's get into it right now. All right, so in this video, I wanted to show you why uh, there's actually an easy way to get Thrivecart to work with Shopify or Shopify with Thrivecart. So a lot of folks, I mean, we talk to people every single day about uh, hooking up Shopify or if Shopify can work with Thrivecart or if I can sell physical products with Thrivecart, all that kind of stuff. And it's a great question. And uh, the whole answer now it really just released is that yes, you can. There is now a direct integration between Thrivecart and Shopify. So you probably might be wondering, you know, because most people think that you just use one or the other. You know, if you're in e commerce, you just basically just use Shopify. And, you know, if you're selling digital products and stuff like that, you're going to use Thrivecart. Well, in this video, I'm going to show you why you can actually make a lot more money by using both. So, let me explain why really quick. So there's a thing that um, that's said, and Josh Bartlett, the founder of Thrivecart, says this pretty often. I might butcher it a little bit, but basically, focused funnels will give you higher conversions. That's not actually a saying totally, um, <laughs> but I'll, I'll basically explain more in a second. But if I go back, so a focused funnel is something like Thrivecart. That's something if you have a landing page, a sales page, and then a checkout page and potentially, you know, some upsells or downsells as well. It's a very focused funnel. It's linear, you know, it's along the line. Whereas if you're thinking like Shopify, and there's nothing wrong with this, it's just a different type of model. Shopify is more of a cart. So that's more of a browsing experience. It's not really a linear way of buying a product. It's more of a, you know, like a shopping, you know, you're going out to the store. That's why it's Shopify, you know, it's, it's an e-commerce platform with a cart loaded up and then you check out at the end. Totally cool. So if you're doing e-commerce, if you're selling physical products and things like that, you want to do both. And here's why. So the focus funnel, that's where Thrivecart comes into play. Uh, the beautiful thing now that everything is actually integrated directly into Shopify, everything you do in Thrivecart will go into Shopify, means that you can totally fulfill everything that you normally would in Shopify and you have all the stats, you can track everything like you normally would, but now you're having the benefit of using this Thrivecart cart to actually create a focus funnel around your e-commerce. And I'm actually gonna show you why you will have the best of both worlds and I created a little visual for you. So in a typical e-commerce Shopify store, you will have, you know, you have your whole platform. Basically, you have your whole shopping experience. That's what this cart's representing. And you have all these different products out there. You might have, you know, t-shirts, cool hats like this fedora, maybe some mugs or cups out there. Whatever the product is, it really doesn't matter. But the point is that you have a variety of products out there. And in e-commerce, most likely you have a ton of products, way more than you ever would with just a funnel that's focused. So here's the problem is that, you know, carts basically create browsers. That's more or less the saying that Josh says is that, you know, carts are going to create browsers. Those are folks that are just moving around, clicking around, seeing products, uh, you know, descriptions, prices, reviews, and then maybe they're adding them to the cart. And if they're adding them to the cart, maybe they're actually going to purchase but it's not focused. So they're more browsers than anything. Obviously you're gonna have your you know, intent buying people and all that fun stuff, but most people are browsers. Now here's the, what kind of happens with this, and this is what most e-commerce uh, product owners will see. And these numbers present basically the amount of revenue that each product represents. So this is all totally hypothetical, but this is very common. It's kind of like an 80-20 type of thing is that most products really aren't going to sell the bulk of your, you know, make up for the bulk of your sales or even your profits, however you want to look at it. But, you know, let's assume simple math in this whole thing. 5% of sales come from this shirt. 
5% from this shirt, 15% of sales come from this cup. That's really good. Uh, you know, 5% come from this cup, five from this hat, 10 from this hat. Cool. That's all great and all, but you might not be totally noticing, or maybe you do notice and you don't know how to optimize why this shirt is bringing five, 55% of your sales, or maybe it's 55% of your profits into your company. And, you know, it's, it's, it's kind of like your cash cow, but with an e-commerce store, it's very difficult to just optimize that one product. And that in lies, uh, that's, that's really where this whole issue comes up to play. So that's why, you know, you're not really optimizing the experience to make the most profits. And if you created something that is linear, something that's more focused around this product, as an example, and maybe pair it up with a bump offer or an upsell or downsell or whatever to maybe a cup or another, or maybe a hat, something like uh, that kind of works with that is you know a cross sell or an add on type thing then you can exponentially make a lot more money and it's way quicker to just test something with a funnel like that so here's an example let's assume that we wanted to create a funnel around that shirt that we know that represents 55% of our sales or profits whatever you want to call it so with thrivecart you can create that focus checkout experience so if you follow me here you can literally create a landing page or a sales page that essentially features this shirt with all of its cool designs, all of its cool features. Maybe it's cool construction. You know, the shirt's amazing, sweat wicking. Uh, it's people are gonna love you and they see you in it. They always say cool things. Maybe there's testimonials, reviews, all that stuff on the sales page that really pumps up this one product. This is not a cart anymore. We're talking about just a sales page for this one t-shirt. And, you know, in doing that, you know, that's maybe built on a lead pages or a click funnels or on a WordPress or something like that. But you're using Thrivecart to capture the payment for that product. And so that is your focus checkout experience. Now, what's really cool is you get this checkout with Thrivecart. And if you don't know about Thrivecart or if you haven't seen the different checkouts, just go to getthrivecart.com. It's on the bottom here. And you'll see a ton of videos with examples. We won't do that right here. Uh, but essentially, with this checkout, now you can actually add in a bump offer. So maybe that's a five, 10, to maybe $50 offer that with a click of a button, they can add that to their order. Uh, they can also add some upsells or some downsells after that first initial sale of the shirt. And that's why I was saying maybe it's a, uh, maybe there's a cup that you want to add in there or a hat that you think that just sells really well or that would pair up with the shirt. You could totally do that and string up some products this way. Now you have all the massive integrations that Thrivecart comes with. That's autoresponders. You can um, automate with so many fulfillment things out there as well. Obviously you probably have that with Shopify, but again, you have a lot of different uh, integrations inside of here. There's tons of videos at Get Thrivecart that show all these integrations. There's a lot. And there's also smart actions and all these things that happen when someone lands on your checkout page or even when they create, uh, when they make the purchase. So you can add people to a list, you can tag them, you can, uh, if they left the checkout without actually placing the order, you can then follow them around with abandoned cart emails and send them uh, you know, emails to try to get them back. Uh, you can put cool tracking on your checkout pages like retargeting pixels and chatbot type things, live chats. All these things you can do with Thrivecart very, very simply, and there's a whole ton of other features can't really even get into all those now, but the point is, is that these funnels are going to create buyers. This is gonna exponentially increase your profits because you're literally cherry picking this product over here. And I'll just kind of go through this again really fast, but you're literally cherry picking your most profitable or your most popular selling product, and you're creating this focus funnel around it. And that's where the power of Thrivecart comes in and the beauty is that, you know, checking, uh, or setting up a checkout kind of experience inside of uh, Shopify, you know, a whole storefront, that could take a month or so, you know, with the amount of products, uh, even if it's a small store, really to dial that in. Now, if you're using something like Thrivecart with a page builder or just a simple WordPress page that you already probably have access to, something free, you can get that done in a day, maybe a couple days if you wanna really deck it out with some cool graphics and then literally you can start running some traffic to that product. 
using your existing email list, Facebook ads, Google ads, uh, social shares, whatever it might be. Um, that is the total power of this whole thing. And it's really cool. It's exciting. And funnels create buyers. So it's the best of both worlds. That's really what you're getting with this. Um, you know, you're going to keep doing your Shopify thing. Nothing wrong with that. That's your storefront. But then you can literally create these focus funnels to exponentially boost your sales and your profits by cherry picking those best products. Or maybe it's not, maybe you're brand new and you just want to test a product. You can do that very simply with these quick funnels. And it's a very inexpensive and fast way uh, to test your products before you build this massive storefront. So even if you don't have Shopify, but you want to get into e-commerce, maybe you start with Thrivecart first and then graduate to Shopify You know, once you get rolling a little bit. So I'm not going to show you exactly how to do this. I'm actually going to tack on the video of how to set up and how to integrate Thrivecart with Shopify. Uh, I'm actually going to... Our buddy Chris and Dale over at Thrivecart uh, created this video and it's amazing. It's way better than I could have done because they have all the integrations in there. So I'm going to pass it over to them to actually show you how to do this. Thank you, uh, Chris and Dale and Josh, all the Thrivecart guys for making that video. They totally did it. Giving them credit for that. Um, and that's it. So let's get into it. In this video, we're going to take a quick look at where to set this up, how to set your products up in Thrivecart to pass orders through to Shopify, and then what it looks like in Shopify itself. So first, let's go take a look at where we set up the integration with Shopify in your Thrivecart account. Under your settings area, we simply need to head over to the integrations area and then go down to fulfillment services and then click on the Shopify option. Here we'll see a list of our existing Shopify accounts and we can integrate with further accounts by clicking this button here. When we integrate with Shopify, we need to enter the store URL. Once you've entered your store name into this field, you'll simply need to click on the button that says, take me to Shopify. You'll then be shown a page which you'll need to agree and approve to the Thrivecart app, and then you'll be taken back to Thrivecart with everything ready to go. So now let's take a quick look at a card example. So here we have an example of a checkout where I'm selling one of my branded mugs. When customers complete orders through this checkout, we're gonna have this passed through to my Shopify store, which is gonna to link to my branded mug in Shopify. We can see that we've got some shipping options here for worldwide shipping, and I'm also allowing customers to buy more than one mug. And we can see that if we add four mugs to the order, the shipping actually increases due to the powerful shipping options we've got set up in Thrivecart. So now it's gonna take a look at how we send orders from this checkout over into our Shopify account. In our product settings, under Fulfillment, we'll have the shipping option when using a physical product. Under here, we can add multiple shipping options. So I'm going to walk you through the steps of adding a shipping option that will fulfill to Shopify. I'm going to click on Add Shipping Option, and we're going to give our shipping option a name. This will display to the customer, so I'm going to call it Worldwide Shipping. Next, we need to choose our fulfillment provider. So because we're going to be passing orders through to Shopify, we're going to be using the Shopify services for fulfillment. So I'm going to click on this drop down here. And I'm going to go down to Shopify and select that. Next, we need to select our Shopify account. So if you have integrated more than one account, you'll need to select that from the drop down list here. And then you can click on Save. Now we can go through and set any shipping options that we want, the amount we want to charge customers for a shipping, and click on Next. We can then obviously choose when the shipping option is available. We're just going to leave this at all the time. We'll go to the next step. And then on the final step as well, we can choose what product this links to in our Shopify account. So in this case, I've got my mug product and I've got the variant of green. So I'm going to select that and click on save. So now when a customer goes through the Thrivecart funnel, an order will be created in Shopify for this product we've just set up in the shipping option. So now let's see how it comes through into your Shopify account. In the orders area under your Shopify account, you'll see that Thrivecart has passed an order through for your product. If we click on this, we can be shown some further details. In this area, we'll be able to see things like the price they paid, how much they paid for shipping, if any taxes were applied, and the total amount. Their customer details, including their name, email, and phone number if collected, along with their shipping and billing addresses. You can then click the Marcus Fulfilled button to be taken through to your Shopify fulfillment options, and as existing Shopify users, we'll assume you know how this area works. And that's the Shopify integration. Simple to use, yet extremely powerful with your Thrivecart funnels and passing orders through to your Shopify account. All right, so just going to wrap it up again. Best of both worlds. And just remember that at the end of the day, 
Funnels will create buyers. It's all about cherry picking those best products or maybe testing with a brand new product with Thrivecart first as a step one and then going from there. I mean, this is literally the way to go. If you wanna get something up fast, you wanna sell your physical product, have no limitations and be extremely focused Thrivecart's the way to do it. So go to getthrivecart.com uh, to see a ton of other content or fire us a message. There's tons of ways to get a hold of us. We have a team that's all ready to, to give you a lot of help. And we have amazing bonuses as well. The best out there. We're the certified partners from Thrivecart, the first and the best. And talk to you soon. Thanks for watching. Joe Fear out.